Last week we heard Mark Zuckerberg tell us the metaverse was the next big thing. Now I think if you're in crypto already, you already knew this, but thanks Mark. What it does signal is big business is now understanding this and getting this. Welcome to the Crypto Rain channel. If you like money and you are looking for a real investor's take on the crypto market, join the Rainmaker family by liking the videos and subscribing with the all notifications button enabled. Today I want to share with you a project that dovetails quite nicely with the coming metaverses. What if you could attend your favorite concerts and even concert locations virtually from anywhere you are in the world? Well, there's a project doing exactly this and they will be having a token launch soon and today we will have their CEO and founder join us and share with us more. So strap in and see what you think of this new way to experience music and events from our own home. Let us welcome Colin Fitzpatrick founder of Animal Concerts. Colin, are you there? I'm here. Nice to meet you, Ryan. Thanks for Yeah. Having me. Thank you so much for joining our audience today. When I saw the details and was reading some of the details on your project, I want to have you on and speak to the audience and tell them what's coming. I mean, metaverses have been a big thing. And, you know, in my thoughts, your project dovetails really well with this. I mean, the coming virtual reality space where in your living room you can be anywhere in the world and experience anything. So do you mind telling the audience a little bit about yourself and what led you to creating Animal Concerts? Sure. Okay, no problem. So um, as, uh, as you said, I'm uh, Colin Fitzpatrick. I'm the founder and CEO of Animal Concerts. Uh, I'm Irish and from Dublin, but I've, I've been living in Dubai for the last three years, uh, which has a really great uh crypto scene. Um, I have a background in tech. I've worked for a lot of the big tech companies for 20 years, Oracle, Salesforce, Dell, HubSpot, etc. And I've been in cryptocurrency since about 2017. Um, myself and a couple of friends just wanted to think about what we could do. And we saw obviously, you know, the metaverse is being massive, but also NFTs and the real world applications of these. So essentially what animal concerts do is we book top 100 artists, we record their uh, concerts and we stream them online. So as you say, uh, we're democratizing concerts because you no longer have to be the one who's lucky enough that your favorite band is coming to the city near you and that you're lucky enough to get a ticket. Uh, we can let anyone around the world attend their favorite concert you know, for a couple of bucks. But we can also uh, record that with the very best technology in 3D and VR. So you can feel like you're dancing on stage from, with your favorite artist from the comfort of your own home anywhere. And I think that's pretty important. Now, I don't have to tell your viewers about how important the, uh, the metaverse is, but some people don't quite realize what's going to come up. And we've seen the challenges that the music industry has had over the past number of years and decades. And, you know, the, the, the sales going down, but everything's going streaming. We're giving the power back to artists to really control this themselves. And that's a pretty big game changer. Now, it's less about the money for them. It's more about their ability to interact and engage with their favorite fans and also create new fans on new platforms. So you've seen the likes of Ariana Grande, 78 million people attended her concert in Fortnite. She made $50 million selling the digital assets. And we believe this is still very young and there's a whole lot more to do. So we have some great people on the team. We've got really fantastic connections with the top three music booking agencies in the world. But one of our founders has been putting on massive events for 15 years, his phone is a Rolodex of celebrities and that's how we've got this really great access to book who we've got so far and we've got lots in the pipeline who I can't really tell you about but will be coming very, very soon. And ultimately we built in a lot of token utility. So you'll purchase a ticket uh, using our cryptocurrency and the ticket will be an NFT. Uh, but we'll also have things like staking and rewards and a whole load of other things built in to create fantastic token utility with burns and enabling the artists to actually integrate and interact with their favorite fans and create really strong engagement, which I think is really important. Um, so ultimately we're taking advantage of several seismic changes in the industry with streaming, with VR, with NFTs. And I think we're really well positioned because we seem to be the only, only group doing kind of all of that together. And that's what I think makes us special. Yeah, I like your laser focus on that aspect of it, right? Because there's a lot of the metaverses saying, oh, we'll be able to do that in our metaverse. But if you have all the connections, you can take your concert into whatever metaverse you want, right? And, yeah. and so then they come to you for the deal. So um, now you mentioned being able to buy the tickets on like $10 tickets to come. So you're not going to be launching on Ethereum then? 
<laughs> no, I mean, obviously you can't sell someone a ten dollar ticket and have them pay forty bucks in gas fees. Um, again, I can't say who, but we've got a phenomenal relationship. I'm getting a really big grant from a, a top fifty blockchain. Um, they're really expanding into the NFT and the metaverse space. Um, we've got some really good partnerships, and you know, we've got the tech. Uh, being built at the moment where we can a create our own metaverse for a very specific concert it can be streamed live so you can just watch it on your phone on your laptop on your tv but if you have an oculus quest or something like that you can have a fully immersive 3d experience and we may even work gamification into that to make it a little bit more interactive like you've seen with some of the really cool games that do that with the music industry Nice. So anyone with a computer, essentially, or even an iPad, could join in. But if they have like the more expensive equipment, then they could have a more immersive experience. Exactly. Makes sense. Now, so you're not launching on Ethereum. Um, the blockchain isn't announced yet. Uh, as far as coming to the market, then you'll probably come on a centralized exchange. Yeah. And so, like, uh, go ahead. We're so. we, we've got we've got we're targeting you know tier one and two exchanges and um, again i can't say but um i'm confident we'll be bumped on some pretty good exchanges in december okay so coming this december right now we're in november yeah this is exciting where this is going and i love what you put together here now you did a test case right i you just did an, an event yeah i saw so some we did our first essentially our proof of concept um we did a party in miami it was at the fontaine blue hotel which is a, an incredible venue and um, we partnered with maxim magazine they were having their halloween party which is all the maxim models and stuff like that uh and we brought we booked a, a rapper called future and i probably assume a lot of your uh, viewers will know him but if you don't he's a really big deal in the rap industry he just had a number one hit with drake a little while ago he's had more top 10 hits in the rap chart than anyone else and he did an incredible concert there uh we filmed it with the very very best technology i mean the company has worked on like avatar and stuff like that um i i do have like a little one minute preview video which i'll share with you at some stage and you can put it on twitter it looked amazing we had animal concerts literally projected with lasers over the entire fontaine blue hotel with models everywhere and i sent a lot of people and investors to it and they all came back with you know, 10 out of 10, incredible experience, and this is what we're going to be doing forward. I'm really interested. So it was a very successful event. Yeah, looking forward to the way this tech is changing the world, and this is just one aspect where there's a great opportunity for the tech that blockchain brought us. I mean, who could have thought when Satoshi Nakamoto was writing the Bitcoin white paper what it would lead to? It would lead to virtual concerts where you could tune in from anywhere in the world. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I mean, you know, this is trying to do the best things with tech and we're not really trying to revolutionize the world here. We're taking established tech and we're just doing new and better things. But what is exciting is I think we're going to be able to really bring a huge amount of non-crypto people onto our platform, which is very, very valuable. The exciting thing about our project is contracted in are these artists that we have great relationships with. They have to and they are incentivized to actually promote us on their social media channels. And because we split the revenues of the NFT sales and also the tickets, you know, they are really, uh, they're, they're really encouraged to, to, to sort of promote us. Now, a lot of these guys have 20, 30, 50 plus million followers across Twitter and Instagram. So we, we're trying to raise a lot of money at the moment and we're aiming to have a dozen, two dozen major artists over the next number of months signed up to a series of concerts all sharing that on their Instagram, on their Twitter, on their Facebook. So I think that we're going to be able to A, build a massive social media following, but B, get a huge amount of people on our platform. And that's very, very valuable because one of the biggest problems that crypto projects have is how do they get non-crypto people in? And we're going to be able to solve that. So that's why we're negotiating with the biggest exchanges because this is something that they really want. Uh, I can see exactly why they really want it because then they'll be able to onboard a bunch of users as they come in trying to partake well awesome that's the questions i had for you colin uh thank you you shared it so quickly and concisely um you're very welcome right? i'm thank just looking through to see if i yeah i want to see if i had any more thoughts so it's coming in a couple well in december we don't know which exchanges they're not launched yet but there will be some centralized exchangers um it'll be on something that can handle transactions fast and cheap yeah. Uh, so it's a quick summary. Uh, thank you, Thanks, Colin. Sir. Very much appreciate your time. Thanks, Ray. 
So I think you all can see why I wanted to have Colin join us and share with us about what they're doing with animal concerts. And you can see why I'm interested in it, very interested. So hopefully it made sense to you. I tried to ask the question so that he could share the vision of what's going on with this and why I think this will be a big part of the future and bringing this mass adoption that we know that part of this mass adoption wave is gonna come this cycle. I think full mass adoption with a, a larger percent of the population will come the following wave. That's just my guess. But you're seeing some things unlock that we can have much bigger masses come in in the coming months. And this is one of those things I think is going to unlock it. So I'm so glad he joined us and shared with us exactly what he's doing with animal concerts because I think that's going to be huge. I did want to thank our sponsors and partners, Chain, for uh, their sponsorship. You know I'm a big holder if you follow this channel. And I use OneSwap. And I have over $110,000 locked up in, in yield farming on OneSwap and Zookeeper. And I'll share with you an updated video on that soon. I know I haven't covered them in a little while, but it's something I've been using to get passive income. So we want to thank them uh, for their sponsorship and partnership. I want to thank all of you for joining in. And if you're ready to level up your crypto game and you're here for life-changing wealth, for some of you that's wife-changing wealth as well, or you're here for nice vehicles or houses, this is exactly the right place to be. So I've got this wrap for you, my Rainmaker family. Enjoy. Came into the space, chasing all of the games, chasing the pumps and all of the hype trains. But like in life, uh, you buy before you could. Was taught to buy when it was boring, like a rainmaker should. I buy when it's down, don't chase the boats that I miss, uh, cause I always make the time in mind. I sit the one out, cause I'm patient like that, and I'll wait for the right time. I sell when it's high, I buy when it's low. They call me rich, they call me smart. I'm just a rainmaker running the show. Calculated investments, I don't leave with my heart. The principles are simple, they're leaving a mark. Why when it's boring, just gotta be smart. I sell when it's hype, like all the channels they pump it. That's when I was selling the parabolic and dump it. They call me rich, they call me smart. I'm a rainmaker, making my own start. I'm with the future, learning the past. Makes it time fly by, years going so fast. The game plan is mine. I'll own it now when I reach the top. Haters asking me how. Cause I'm a rainmaker, investments are low. And I follow what I learn, not relying on luck. Uh, the time is never better. The time like the present is next. Five years is a gift and a feeling like heaven. I'm committed to learn, to study and to know that nothing comes easy, but when knowledge to gain show. Sticking out this one consumer will come a bear market. Learning and growing and when it's slow would be the target. They say it's come out, Bitcoin is dead. The massive decreases can get to your head. I'm sticking around, the time is better. I'm strong like that, I'll let the others be fretters In two years time the ball will bring back the gains That makes it worth the effort cause here comes the rain So let's go rainmakers, let's make it all happen The goal with the hate, they the haters be crapping I'm here for five years, let's do this together The time is right, the time could be better They call me rich, they call me smart I'm a rainmaker, making my own start I'm with the future, learning the past Makes the time fly by, years going so fast This game plan is mine, I'll own it now When I reach the top Haters asking me how Cause I'm a rainmaker Investments I love And I follow what I learn Not relying on luck uh, Haters be hating The time to slow down Addressing what to say When I'm wearing my crown They're chasing green candles Like someone who was new I got a vision that was bigger Helping me to push through I'm still human And sometimes it is rough And that's what makes me special Simply I stay tough Cause I'm a rainmaker Investments I love And I follow what I learn Not relying on luck